Today we're taking a closer look at the Grand Cru from Sablier and what makes this offering different from other boutique and micro brands. That's coming up right after this. The Grand Cru was designed by Mr. Casey and assembled in Princeton, New Jersey. The design was inspired by wine and is often referred to as the Wine Watch. This line's name, the Grand Cru, actually means great growth in French and is a wine classification for that region. With its wine-inspired design cues, the goal was to create a long-lasting timepiece that was comfortable to wear and incredibly legible, and the Grand Cru has done just that. Let's review the specifications before discussing its characteristics in further detail. Please excuse any scratches and dings on this piece as it's been thoroughly put through its paces. The Grand Cru is 50 meter water resistant with, based on my caliper measurements, a case that is 43.5 millimeters at its widest point at the base and tapers up to 40 millimeters with a thickness of 13 millimeters and a lug width of 22 millimeters. The crown is a screw down crown at the two o'clock position for comfort of wear and has the same concave design as the crystal. The case is held in place with a leather band and signed deployant clasp. The band features a quick release spring bar feature which makes strap removal painless. While most micro brands often use the Japanese Miyota 9015 movement, visible through this display back is the Swiss ETA 2824 Tac2 movement in its more unusual brass finishing with a customized rotor. You can also see on the case back that each piece is numbered because every version of the Grand Cru is limited to only 250 pieces, a fairly common practice for boutique and micro brands. This particular piece is 135 of 250 and retails for 2100 US dollars. It's not unusual to see pieces with ETA movements at this price point. However, those brands often have a long history in watchmaking that help consumers justify the cost. So let's discuss the unique elements of this design that help explain its price point. First and foremost, any time that a company searches for case manufacturers, they're able to choose from case designs and options that those specific manufacturers have produced in the past. Naturally, that's gonna keep the cost low, but also provides yet another case in a sea of wrists full of similar cases. The case on the Grand Cru is completely designed by Mr. Casey, and as a result, nearly every aspect of the piece requires custom manufacturing. As everyone knows, anytime you ask for or order something custom, it's going to be reflected in the price tag. The case is a unique Sablier design created to resemble the shape and taper of a wine glass. This design makes for a very comfortable wear, even on my 6.5 inch wrist. Protecting the dial is the first of its kind complete with US patent. It's the concave sapphire crystal, which also has dual AR coating. This design protects the sapphire crystal more so over the long term by ensuring that no part of the crystal passes the top of the case, while the curvature reduces glare and ensures great visibility. To accommodate the concave crystal, all other aspects of the dial are also custom made, meaning you have a concave dial with precisely curved hour, minute, and seconds hand to ensure a smooth sweep and accurate timekeeping, and require a stringent quality control process. The second hand of all Grand Cru variations, with the exception of one, has the second hand designed to resemble a corkscrew bottle opener. For those of you undecided on how you feel in regard to the corkscrew design, there is a white dial version that has a standard second hand. Sablier is also looking at releasing a smaller version of the Grand Cru collection in the near future. My personal experience wearing this piece for the last three weeks was extremely enjoyable. The large hour and minute markers make it very legible and easy to read. The only area I found myself left wanting is that there's no loom applied to anything on the dial, which would be nice to see on at least the minute and hour hands in addition to the cardinal hour markers of 12, 3, 6, and 9. While the leather band and deployant clasp have the quick release spring bar feature, making strap removal easy, this is only really convenient if you have other straps that have a similar feature. Otherwise, you're going to need an additional 22 mil spring bar on hand to use different strap combinations and is perhaps a small detail that Sablier should consider providing in the future. I loved that I knew I wasn't going to see anyone else wearing a piece that had a case similar to the one I had on. 
This piece for me represents a perfect marriage between contemporary design and classic minimalism. A change of strap makes this piece just as suitable to casual wear as it is for dressier occasions. And as with most pieces, different straps, such as the NATOs you see here, completely change the look of the Grand Cru. Aesthetically and technically, the Grand Cru was an absolute pleasure to wear and stare down at. I'd like to thank the Sablier team for sending this piece for review on the channel. You can find a link to their website in the video description. I'd love to hear what you guys love and maybe don't love about this offering. If you enjoyed this video and found it useful, please do hit the like button. As always, if this is your first time here, don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. That's it for this one. CG out.